the Ford 901. This is an original Ford 901 manufactured by Graphic Reproductions. It has not been restored. It is painted a two-tone gray and red with a black steering wheel. The seat is supposed to be painted black as well. The fenders are faded gray on this original. The rims are supposed to be gray on the 901 as well. The front rim is a smooth rim with an original Swan tire. The 901 also has a different grille than the 900. It has a grid type grille. It also has variations in the holes on the bottom sides of the tractor. This 901 has the stamped steel fenders and a different stamped steel seat than the last 900. Either version would be correct. The motor is closed in on the 901s, which makes it much harder to install the headlight. The raised cast-in Ford lettering is painted on the left side, also on the right side, and on the stamped steel fender. Here is a nice close shot of the grid-type grille on the 901. It has 7 by 1 and 1 quarter inch rib tread flat face swan tires mounted on smooth rims, as well as the low dome hubcap. We don't know if this is correct or not. Here is a close-up of the swan on the side of the tire. And a close-up of the words, puncture proof. The rear tires have star rims and 12 by 1 and 3 quarter inch lug tread tires with puncture proof on the side. This unique hub has three bolts. Here's the teardrop solid rubber pedal with metal ends and the domed push nut. And here is the steering wheel on the 901. Here you can see the lower angle of this steering shaft as opposed to the 900 steering shaft, which is pointed straighter up into the air. The gear shift lever with the knob that should be painted gray. The stamped steel seat, unique to this tractor, and the seat bracket. The hitch is merely a hole in the casting. The Ford 901.